If you're looking for that hot stuff, look at these cute little bottles and so pretty! Jalapeno, pineapple, whatever you want. Okay, jalapeno, I know. <laughs> Ooh, so hot! Here we are at another festival and it's so amazing what vendors do. Look at Garlic Brothers. They've used egg cartons and you get a, a variety pack of different garlics. How clever, a nice use for your, your uh, egg cartons. And then you can put them right in your field, in your field as mulch. Well. So no waste, no fuss, no muss, just yummy garlic. <laughs> Yuppie! And everything is vegan, except the garlic cheese dip. Oh, okay. Nothing, but it's gluten free. Okay. okay. And we use everything that we use mostly with Ontario products. As uh, we shop local, buy local, except items like mango, you cannot get here. But you know what? We, but we use the best products out there. Yeah. Right, beautiful. Oh, you never know what you're going to find at the festival. 
here we are, we found the typist. She does poetry on the sky. One word, and she composes a, uh, a poem for you on her selectric. Can you imagine? No power required. <laughs> so my word was laughter. Yes, it was. I'm going to just read the end part. So when our steps seem to stop, and all we need is a spattering of child self reincarnation, laughter breaches every person never lost in translation. So beautiful, so poetic. I love it. What a great concept. <laughs> Off to the next one. <laughs> Thanks, Nicole. Welcome. <laughs> Have you ever heard of that? Have you ever had it? Oh my gosh, it's sweeter, syrupier, and tastes like umami. Is that how you say it? <laughs> and this beautiful booth won second prize at the Royal Agricultural Fair in 2019 for, for hot sauce. <laughs> Yippee! Garlic fest. This is Kathy Elizabeth, more composting for great garlic. Through inspirational storytelling and an incredible sense of humor, Kathy has raised the level of awareness about environmental conservation. Kathy's thought-provoking style of speaking inspires individuals to take action and do something. Over 75,000 students have seen her presentation. She's also been featured in a variety of media, including print, television, and radio. Kathy is also the subject of a documentary, Squirm, the Kathy's Calling Composter Story.